Good morning everyone, I'm Craig. And I'm Mel. And you're with Love and Diz World and today we're trying Contempo Cafe, which is the quick service location here at the Contemporary. We're really excited, we've done it for lunch and we have had it for breakfast, but we haven't filmed it before. But let's see what the food's like today as we completed our mobile order and we'll take you with. See you inside. So currently what you do is you place your mobile order and then uh, when your number's called, just walk over to where those cast members are standing and grab your food and beverage and continue on your way. Currently, if you have a drink, uh, you just basically ask for a drink and they'll get it for you. This used to be self-service. Here's a closer look at the mobile pickup spot and of course, the lovely monorail up above. This is what I got for breakfast. I got the gigantic Mickey waffle that came with a sausage and bacon. That is a huge Mickey waffle. And of course it came in this a lovely presentation of the cardboard box. Can I, am I allowed to eat this? Melissa got the uh, egg, cheese, and bacon sandwich. And Connor wanted a lovely chocolate chip muffin. So I have two kind of problems. One was that we did the mobile order and this is the first time we've ever experienced this. Our food was just sitting up there waiting and waiting and waiting and uh, we never got the page. Uh, then when we finally did get the page, I walked up and I said, well, this food's been here for a while. They said, yeah, they forgot to do it, which I mean, that happens, it does. Um, but our food was just a little cold. Secondly, if you look at this Mickey waffle, it is not really, a waffle it's more like a I don't know a chip it's not very fresh um, not fresh at all I had a chance to try the sausage and the bacon both of those were good uh, but I am just very disappointed in this waffle so I'm really trying hard not to be too critical here but this is by far I I don't think I've ever seen a waffle like this here on Disney property I mean <laughs> um, <laughs> it's <laughs> it literally is like a bag of potato chips i i don't know this, this is not a not a good waffle all right give it a shot it has an okay flavor to it the salt of the ham really comes out and as you can see it's just kind of Punch meat, which I haven't really seen ham like that on breakfast sandwiches on Disney property, at least the sandwiches I've done. Um, there is some flavoring on the egg. You really get the cheese flavor coming through. I'm not really a fan of the soggy, fluffy bread. So I'll trade you. I offered it to Craig because I looked at his waffle and it was almost a foot long when he lifted <laughs> the fork. But <laughs> I have cheese and he doesn't eat cheese, so he, he already passed on that. It's okay. I don't think it's the best breakfast sandwich, and if you watch any of the other reviews, I think the breakfast sandwich we got at Pop Century was actually a lot better than this. Yeah, no, no comparison, um, and honestly. And I think it was like two dollars cheaper. So I think this was seven ninety nine, if I remember correctly. Like I said, we'll put the menu on there so you can see the ingredients in it and the price for it. It's just okay. I'm a little disappointed because we really enjoyed the Contempo Cafe breakfast. Um, when we stay here, it's something we do every trip. And I've never had the sandwich. I'm not sure if I'm gonna order this the next time we come. All right, so how was the chocolate chip muffin, Connor? Two thumbs up? I think we're gonna have a segment with Connor. How many thumbs does this get? And then we're gonna put like a sticker or an animation come in like, Connor gives it two thumbs up. As we just saw, Connor just gave that chocolate chip muffin two thumbs up. Mel, you have some chocolate chip muffin on your fork. What do you think of it? So I've already had a couple bites. Connor told me that it was the best chocolate chip muffin he's ever had. I don't know if that's just today versus yesterday. All the thumbs up is coming into the <laughs> screen. <laughs> so I just had to try it. Um, based on our eh, average things that we got, I had to give the muffin a try. And overall, very chocolatey. It's really soft. I like it a lot. I think that we 
like the pastries here. Um, they had a cinnamon roll that looked really, really good, and I kind of wish I would have gotten that. But overall, two Connor thumbs up for the chocolate chip. Yeah, I wish I would have got the cinnamon roll as well. Um, it probably would have beat my potato chip waffle. Mm -hmm. um, I just, I'm sorry, I just can't. I can't get over this. I, I've literally never had a waffle look like this. But anyway, I'm glad you enjoy the muffin. Uh, I'm glad you somewhat enjoyed your sandwich. Um, but yeah, on to the next. So we just wrapped up our breakfast here at Contempo Cafe and I try not to be too negative, but I also think I need to be honest with everybody because you watch us, you pay your money to come down here and have a good dining experience. And usually I'm extremely high on Contempo Cafe. It's I one know. of my it's one of our favorite, favorite quick service locations. However, this time I think breakfast fell completely flat, at least on my end. That waffle was almost uh, unedible. It was just not good. It, I never had a waffle just fall apart and, and break into pieces like that. Just And for how long we had to wait, we waited almost 25 minutes for the mobile order and then uh, we didn't get notification of the mobile order until like 25 minutes later and yet at the same time our food was just sitting up there getting cold so I don't think that helped. Yeah. And what do you think of your sandwich? It's a little soggy. I, I do think that our food sat there a little bit. Um, I wish the bread was a little bit crunchier. It had an okay flavor. Um, it was a little salty, but not too salty. So again, it's kind of an average sandwich for me. And I definitely had better at different locations. Like I said earlier, Pop Century Sandwich was by yeah. far way better for I think $2 or $2.50 less. So I could pick that over this. Again, I'm just disappointed because we love Contempo Cafe. It's something that you know we always try to fit into our trip when we can. And we actually, when we got in for our trip, we ate there for dinner last night. Okay. And it was kind of the same thing. So I'm not sure if it's just our luck. But again, you need to try it out, particularly if you're staying here. You can have a different experience. Um, but maybe look at some different options on the menu or try some of the pastries, the muffins, because they were very fresh and delicious. But we do hope you enjoyed today's video. If you did, make sure to give us a thumbs up, subscribe to the channel. We'd really appreciate it. As always, be on the lookout for new content. And don't forget to join us next time, and we'll show you why we are loving this world. Have a great day, everyone.